hello guys welcome to civil engineering youtube channel here in this video we will talk about the different types of foundation uh, used in the civil engineering okay we will see all types of foundation which are uh, used in the civil engineering with the help of picture okay so let's start the video here first of all before different types of footing let us uh, learn why foundation is provided okay so our first point is distribute it distribute the weight of structure over a large area of soil okay if we provide foundation below the column then what will happen it will uh, distribute the load coming on this column to the large area okay the second point is it avoid the unequal settlement okay if we do not provide the foundation below the column then what will happen sometime this column will go uh, down to the swell uh, sometimes this uh, uh, column may goes uh, down to the swell and it makes uh, it make unequal settlement okay and it may uh, collapse the building or any structure okay so it avoid it means it protect from unequal settlement However, it prevent the lateral movement of the structure okay uh, it prevent from the uh, leaning it means moving the structure from one side from to another side for so much distance okay so it uh, prevent the lateral movement of the structure lateral means side movement okay and at the last point uh, it increase the structure stability okay it make the structure stable okay and uh, it uh, protect from the uh, uh, natural calamities like uh, uh, earthquake like uh, wind load etc okay uh, our next chapter is the different types of foundation uh, which i have summarized here the different types of uh, uh, foundation is summarized as a shallow foundation and deep foundation okay there are especially two types of foundation shallow foundation and deep foundation and shallow foundation is further categorized into isolated spread uh, foundation wall footing combined footing raft or mat foundation i will show you later one by one with the help of picture okay now the deep foundation is categorized into three types pile foundation pyre foundation and cushion foundation okay so let us uh, uh, read one by one okay so here the first of all i would like to tell you the difference between the um, shallow foundation and deep foundation okay the foundation whose depth is less than or equals to the width of the foundation is called shallow foundation for example we have a ground level like this okay and now we have to dig a foundation below the swell now the depth is how much for example depth is 3 meter and width is how much 5 meter okay so this point is telling us that if the depth of foundation is less than or equals to the width then this is known as shallow foundation okay here this foundation will be what shallow foundation but if the depth is here the if the depth is uh, 5 meter and width is only 3 meter then this will be our what deep foundation okay this is the clear concept now the second point is a shallow foundation is used for small construction like two or three story building and the deep foundation is used for a large and heavy construction like bridge okay so i hope you got understand about the shallow and deep foundation now let us uh, see one by one what are the uh, uh, deep foundation okay so first of all i would uh, like to tell you about the deep, deep foundation the first uh, types of foundation in deep foundation is spread footing okay in this types of footing the base of the member transmitting the load to the soil is made wider so as to distribute the load over the wider area okay spread footing is for single column okay you can see here this is a single column and this foundation this footing is made for only one column okay and uh, this types of footing is known as what spread footing it uh, it take the load from the column and spread in the wide area this is known as spread footing okay next types of footing is our wall footing this type of footing is uh, uh, generally constructed in the wall and it is used for the low weighted structure like compound wall and boundary wall okay so this types of footing 
is same as the speed footing but its width its length is higher than the width okay so uh, this types of footing is known as wall footing okay now next types of footing is our combined footing guys according to its name the uh, combined footing is the mixture or combination of two footing okay you can see here in this picture the footing of this column and footing of this column has combined with each other so this types of footing is known as combined footing a footing in which two column are combined together to bear a load of structure is known as combined footing okay and now the condition of use it means where these types of footing are used so when the column is very near to each other so that their footing overlap for example if the footing of this uh, if the column is very near to each other then its uh, footing may overlap with each other so it will be better to provide the combined footing uh, uh, between them okay second point is when the bearing capacity of soil is less require more area under the individual footing the second point is when the bearing capacity of soil below the footing is what less okay bearing capacity it means the capacity of bearing load okay when the end of the footing third point is when the end footing is near the property line so that its footing cannot extend in the direction okay it means that if uh, the footing its footing uh, for example for this column the footing is like this okay and for, uh, for this column the footing is like this but one condition may arise when there is no space at the side of this column then we have to provide a footing like this okay because there is no any area beside this column so at this time we have to make a footing like this okay so when the uh, end footing uh, near the property line uh, when the footing is near the property line then we can use this types of footing now the next footing is our raft or mat foundation guys this types of footing are generally used for large building large structure so that uh, so that the uh, uh, foundation below the single column will not uh, consolidate below the soil okay and the structure remain stable here a raft or mat is combined footing that cover the entire area beneath the structure it means that this types of raft and uh, mat uh, foundation uh, is uh, uh, cover all all the columns uh, all the columns are bonded in single footing so this types of footing is known as what raft or mat footing and support all the walls and column it only not support the columns but also support the rcc wall or uh, bricks wall on it okay so our next types of footing is our what deep foundation we have completed shallow foundation now it is deep foundation so let us see in deep foundation the first types of foundation is pile foundation okay so in pile foundation pile foundation is adopted for heavily loaded structure that is erected in soil having low bearing capacity structure are transferred to group or pile through no, through pile caps okay guys this types of footing are used where the soil have low bearing capacity it means the soil which have uh, low uh, capacity of bearing load so this types of footing are used uh, pile uh, pile foundation are used and where the structure uh, well the soil bearing capacity is low now let us see the condition for use where this types of footing are used okay so this types of footing are used the load of the superstructure is heavy and its distribution is uneven its distribution is uneven it means that when the structure have somewhere sometime uh, more load and some somewhere less load so more more load and somewhere less load load so this type at this time we have to use this types of uh, footing okay now the next point is the top of the soil has a poor bearing capacity okay now these types of uh, footing are used when the soil below the foundation is low uh, bearing capacity of uh, soil is low but at the bottom the soil bearing capacity is high next type, uh, point is the sub soil water level is high so that the pumping of water from the 
open trends for the sale of foundation is difficult and uneconomical. So, guys, uh, this type of structure are used where the uh, water level is beside this foundation or water level is much above the uh, soil. Okay, so these types of foundation are used for deep foundation. Now, our next types of foundation is pile foundation. Okay, guys, this type of foundation is same as the pile foundation. The difference is only that a pile foundation consists of cylindrical column of large diameter to support and transfer large superimposed load to the film strata below okay so this is the same as a pile foundation but the difference is that it have a cylindrical what cylindrical uh, column okay it has cylindrical column and has large diameter okay and pile foundation is preferred in the location where the top strata consists of the decomposed rock overlaying strata of sound rocks it means that where this types of footing are used where the uh, lower strata it means lower layer of the soil is of rocks strata below the soil is hard okay so this is known as pyre foundation and this types of foundation is known as pyre foundation the next types of foundation is our kishan foundation that's uh, generally we see this kishan foundation in the bridge okay so kishan foundation is ready made hollow cylinder depressed into the soil up to the desired level and then filled with concrete which ultimately converts to the foundation so guys it is mostly used as a bridge pyre these types of foundation are used mostly in the bridge pyre and uh, this uh, in this types of uh, bridge, uh, in these types of uh, foundation first of all a kishan it means uh, a hollow cylindrical or rectangular uh, kishan is made after that concrete is poured in it and then a uh, superstructure is made on this uh, foundation so this types of foundation is known as kishan foundation okay so guys these are the different types of foundation used in the civil engineering i hope you understood all types of foundation okay so so this much for today for more important video please like this video and subscribe my channel for more update thank you